cute in your baseball socks, babe Bobby. Yeah, it's not easy having a candy bar named after you. If I get you out, I'm going to kiss you, babe Bobby. Yuck! No, you're not, because I'm going to hit the wall way up there! We can take all my dolls and play beauty salon. Yeah, right. Come on, Bobby, it'll be fun. We'll give them a seaweed wrap, remove all their unwanted hair with hot wax, and then scrub off all their old dead skin cells. Ah! Uh, uh, I might scare Roger too much. I know. Let's play America's number one most favorite home game, hide and seek. You're it! <laughs> Dr. Bobby Kendall, wrongly convicted of wrapping dolls in stinky seaweed, Dr. Bobby is forced to live life as a hunted man. Okay, I want a hard target search of every old place, nice place, and hiding place in the area. Bobby the Fugitive. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. Ready or not, here I come. to the dentist. Bobby, you're gonna have to go home now, honey. Did you ever notice how parents like to say it's time to do something boring just when their kids are really having fun? Pull, tuck, grasp, try. Ah, I guess I better try the back door. <laughs>
trouble. Ah! We've got to find a way to get in, Roger. Ah! I know. If I do something bad, Mom will come out and catch me. She always does. I'm picking my nose. I'm picking my nose with both hands. Right now. Unless there's somebody around to see you being it. Ah! Nobody's yelling at me. What do I do now? <laughs> Roger! Where did everybody go? Ah! I don't want to be home uh, by myself. I can't believe they lost me. Okay, be calm. Don't panic. I need to keep my head when all the ones around me are gone. I need to. I wish I had some cookies, which I do. I need a plan. I have a plan. The plan Mom and Dad made me remember for when I get lost. When you come home and you're all alone and there's no one to take care of you, if you've already knocked and the door is locked, and here's what you should do. You gotta have a plan. Think of a place where you can go. It's good to have a plan. Maybe a neighbor that you know. You really need a plan. But if you don't get there on foot, it's best to have a plan. You better just stay put. If you're prepared, know your phone number and address. You won't be scared. Cause if you find yourself in a mess, you'll be glad. You can bet. You You'll never forget. A uh, plan. Yeah. You gotta have a plan. Is there a place where you can go? It's good to have a plan. Maybe a neighbor that you know. You really need a plan. But if you think you're there on foot, it's best to have a plan. You better just stay put if you're prepared. Know your phone number and address. You won't be scared. Cause if you find yourself in a mess, you'll be glad. I could hide in my closet. No, 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 no. There's a monster that lives in there. I could hide under my blankets till somebody found me. But how do I get in? The front door is locked and the back door. I need a secret entrance. Enter the Temple of Gloom, but I'm not just any man, I'm California Generous! Ah! Hey, look at this! All my socks that got lost in the dryer! again in my own room with my pet and my shelf and Captain Squash. If that's my room and Mom and Dad's room is next to my room, then that's Mom and Dad's room. I can see better from up here. 
Maybe if I go higher, I can see if Mom's in her room. Mom, I'm up in the tree! Oh, Wobbly! No problem. Yo! Give me your hand! Give me your hand! Come on! You've got eight of them! Just give me one! Nobody's home. First, I'm supposed to go to Jackie's house. And if nobody's there, I'm supposed to go to Mean Mr. Jones' house. But Mean Mr. Jones said I'm supposed to stay off his lawn. How am I, how am I gonna get to his house without getting on his lawn? That's how I can do it. A tunnel! I can dig it. Mean Mr. Jones marks the spot. But so far away. Yes, Zooks! What am I gonna do now? I know how I can get to Mean Mr. Jones's house. I'll slide across the clothesline like a super spy. Here's your double raspberry smoothie, just like you asked. Shaken, not stirred, Mr. Um... Jenrick. Bobby Jenrick. <laughs> You look cute with a mustache, Mr. Bobby. Yuck! Oh, Finga! You tricked me! He made me do it, Bobby. You know how mean he can be. Forgive me? Sorry. One kiss for customer, sweetheart. <laughs> because they always have food on them. Mean Mr. Jones! It's me, Bobby! The kid that was on your lawn today! Three times! Well, uh, I guess it was more like four times! Mean Mr. Jones! Come back! Mean Mr. Jones was my last hope. I remember when I could just walk in right through all these doors. Now, none of them open. Oh, I did everything Mom and Dad said I was supposed to. I sung the song with my address and phone number and I went to the neighbors' houses, but they were all gone. I don't know what to do. I've never been this alone before. Looking at me? You looking at me? 
else here? Maybe I'm nuts, and that's why the squirrels are looking at me. From now on, I guess it'll just be me and the squirrels. Lord of the Yard, Squirrel Boy. Raised by a family of squirrels, he has learned their ways. And the ways of the wild. <laughs> he and his faithful pet, Rajo, search the trees for an end to their loneliness. But find it on the ground below. and find food for dinner. Dinner with Squirrel Boy. I'm going to need a new outfit. It's such a jungle out there. I hope I can find something on sale. Open the door! It's me, Squirrel Boy! Ah! Ah! Me locked out! What is all this fuss and feathers about here now yet? Oh, Mommy, you, you found me. All the, all the doors were locked and I yelled and yelled and nobody came. Well, Bobby, I had that gee golly hair dryer on super high and... Well, look, see here, the screen door is not locked. It's just stuck, don't you know? Oh, well, would you look at those footprints? Now, who in the big wide world could have... Bobby, Jackie's mom called me 10 minutes ago and said she was sending you home. Now, I know it's a two-minute walk from there to here. So, little Mr. Man, where in the Sam Hills of Wisconsin have you been for the last eight minutes? Shouldn't I be asking her that question? Okay, now, Bobby, let's go over the new improved plan. Don't talk to strangers, of course. Yeah, right. And and if you're lost, remember the song with your address and phone number in it. Okay, and if you're at home and locked out, go to the houses of neighbors that you know. And if no one's at the neighbor's house, stay right on your own porch until somebody comes home. And last but not least, if you see a policeman, you should ask him for help. Any questions? Yes. Should I go turn the hose off now? Well, Gee, the Willard. water and power department's gonna love our bill this month. <laughs> so, Bobby, it must have been pretty scary being locked out of the house, huh? Nah, I just huffed and I puffed and I blew the house down. Bobby, that didn't happen. That was the big bad wolf. Was he locked out of his house, too? No. <laughs> it wasn't even his house. Then what does he have to do with today's show? Uh... <laughs> Some, sometimes you confuse me, Bobby. I'm a kid. That's my job. 